Hi guys, this is Kelly, also known on Twitter as Kelly in 1977, and I wanted to do an unboxing for you guys today. Um, I actually saw this ad on Facebook, and it's a game that comes in six boxes like this. Um, they're $33 a piece. The first one, I believe, I saved 25% um, on the first box, and it's called Hunt a Killer, and it gives you everything that you need. And you also use your computer as well. It has a database and you get some emails from the person who hired you to do this investigation. Um, and it brings you sometimes to real websites and sometimes ones that they made up for the game. Um, and so it comes in this box. Uh, it lets you know when they have processed, when they have actually delivered through the mail and when it comes to your home you will get an email um, so this comes with this is the second box so the first box I got this notepad everybody gets a free notepad with each box that they get and they also have boxes from the past that go on sale so the next box I'm going to get um, will be the one that is on sale and I get all six boxes at one time um, and I believe the ship and the handling will be cheaper as well. And uh, when they're on sale, they go anywhere from 160 to like I've seen 115. Um, you know, $33 a box. You get six boxes. That's almost $200. Um, they start off with the newer boxes. Like say the one before this will probably be 180, but it's still a $20 savings. Any which way you want to do it. But you always get one of these and uh, you know we have all our our notes in here and uh, the second box we got this pin um, this takes place in a theater um, this is uh, a body was found 80 years after the person went missing and uh, they gave us this as an evidence piece um, very very quality made the stitching's fantastic the fabric's good um it didn't say who it belonged to but i believe it belonged to the actress that went missing um you always get uh this is what the official letters look like that this person sends you so this person wants to make sure that her grandparents aren't murderers so she's handing you everything that she can find. So uh, each box will have a different letter or a couple letters. Um, you always get this where you can get hints with your cell phone or you can go on there. Um, they always tell you exactly what you're getting to make sure you're not missing anything. Um, like This is a delivery note. Not really important, but they send you whatever um, articles they actually put together. So this would be the woman or the actress that went missing. Really good quality. Um, these letters are in cursive. Um, they do give you it in the database so that you can read it easily. But very professionally done. The people who was helping with this um, murder mystery boxes for Hunt a Killer are professional writers who have done books. Um, and there's about six of them for this one alone. Um, here's the second police report that we had. The first box had an autopsy, so you knew exactly um, any trauma from the past, what trauma she had now when her body was found. They make it look very professional. And there's just pages of this of what happened, who witnesses are. Um, stuff like this, which tells you what deliveries they had, what they were making, what they were paying out. And I'm not sure what the musical notes are yet. Um, we've gone through two boxes. We have three waiting for us and we're just waiting for the next one next month and uh, it should hopefully be cooler next month and we will just dive into it next month 
And this is the letter from the woman who has hired you. And she signs it. And uh, you get a password, as you can see there. It's in caps. For the website, you need to put in Porter for the login name. Um, this pin came with the first box. It's hard to see because my phone, but it's like a skeleton head. And then it always comes in this purple envelope. Like I said, it's very well put together um, for $33 a box. The first box took us two and a half hours to get through. And then what you do is you use your computer and you email Julia, who is the person who hired you. And you got to write one sentence and then you got to write for the first box what you thought the murder weapon was. And the email will confirm within five minutes. It's an automatic confirm. It's looking for one word. Um, and we got that right. And the second one was who absolutely did not commit the murder, which was this box. And we got that one right. So the third box, which I have them, um, the first, second, like I got them in order here. So we just grabbed from the top. Um, that one's going to be the same thing. Who can you say could have done it? So slowly you cross off the people, the suspects. Um, if I remember correctly, there's eight suspects and there's six boxes. So within one of these boxes, probably towards the end, we're going to have to say out of three people, probably like one or two who want the killer. Because there's only six boxes and we only took one person out in the two boxes. So right now it leaves seven people and four boxes. So... By the end of the last box, you will decide who the killer is. Um, so it's kind of like a clue game or one of those dinner theater murder mysteries of who did it. Um, it is enjoyable. I like it. Every single box, you do get a collectible. The last box that we got that I opened, I didn't... There's three there, and there's one that I didn't open. Um, so one, we got a collectible purse. And it has those little spackle things on it. And it's very well made. I'm actually going to use it for my ASMR videos. And the one underneath that for the fourth box, we opened that. And we got a, um, a cigarette holder where you would put your cigarette, a notepad, and a lighter. Um, all made out of metal. So the last one we just got Friday. I don't know what's in it. Um... But yep, that's what this is all about. And it comes in this nice box, delivered to you. It fits in my mailbox. And my mailbox actually closes almost all the way, which is good. My mailbox is black, so it kinda merges with the color. So if somebody's walking by, I don't really see it. Um, and you have to come up my driveway to see my mailbox. So I really think this is a good product. The next product I'm going to try is a computer game that I saw on Facebook. And um, the one that they're advertising, they have it on sale for $17. It's supposed to be $25. And uh, they go between $15 and $25. And it's, it's kind of like a murder or mystery investigation um, where you got to search for clues and you're in different, it's all in different areas, different themes. So I really want to try that one because on the website they have absolutely great, amazing um, ratings. So did this one. So nothing's ever happened. I use PayPal. Um, uh, so, you know, you get one a month, you get six boxes. That's six months of charges. Never had a problem. If you don't want to wait, um, say you order on the first, then it'll be the first every month. They'll take the money out of your PayPal or your credit card, and they'll send it to you within two days. Um, if you don't want to wait, you can always access it early, but you have 10 days to do it. Um, if not, then you have to wait until the following month, which is also a good service. They don't charge you anything extra for that. Um, so I do highly recommend To Hunt a Killer, and it's just huntykiller.com. You can just look it up in your search if you're not sure if you're putting it in right. 
Um, so I highly recommend it. it it's, it's great. First box, two and a half hours. The second box took an hour and 45 minutes. Um, it depends how much information they give you and how much you have to sift through. Um, so this can easily be anywhere between, I would say, a 10 and a 15 hour game, depending how well you read and how great you are connecting the dots. And again, they got a Facebook group for help. You can also get a hint from them. So, you know, you just keep plugging away until you get the correct answer. They, there's no uh, limit on that. Um, I hope you liked my review, my unboxing of Hunt a Killer board game that you can play with your family. I hope you have a great day. Thank you for watching. Bye.